Day 4, Task from Event, Airship Part Again and with Coat of Arm. And I'll start with Coat of Arm. Right now I have a headache and I'm lazy to think too much, so this is what I do, upgrade, and dismantle then upgrade again while watching the score. But stay tuned, because I will tell you an easy way, increase the score without calculating using the score table. And how to make a decision whether to buy airship parts first or badges. Score now 1,900,000 And I can make a basic RA The score is 1,400,000 If I did, then my score would be over 3,300,000 But not enough to reach the next reward I'm sure I can reach the target score of 3,500,000 since there's still material left. So in principle I try so that all materials can be used. I'm only missing 100,000 scores again. Now I just need to find a way to use all the materials. This is a simple way without calculating the score if there are only a few flaws, namely paying attention to the material. This method can also be used for gemstones, curiosity, and airship parts, but don't do it for equipment and guard weapons. Because you will lose the benefits. I just lack a little more Pyrar ingot material, I'll figure out how to get it. The shortfall is about 1500. Worth 30 pearls. While the reward is only 23 pearls. It's not worth it. Let's check in the shooting gallery. Have to get the third reward or six coins and do two times, but better than using pearls. It's a luck, got it with three coins. So this is the point of using six coins. To earn different material rewards, such as Pyrar ingots, precision components, lava crystals, sun hearts, or others. And if you don't want that reward, then one coin is much better.
next airship part. I still have material left, so it can still improve the others that use more materials. Only increase the score a little, let's find another way to use more material. Just lacking a bit of material to enhance this. Far beyond the reward target. That's what often happens if I don't do the math. But it doesn't matter then my head hurts more. And most importantly the reward is achieved. And the remaining material is too little, so it can no longer increase the score for the next reward. Actually I was able to make R9, and get additional rewards, because my pearls are enough to buy 160 handbooks. But I'm not going to do that, because tomorrow is a troop training event, and I need badges to upgrade the training buildings. If I use all these pearls then I won't be able to get T12 tomorrow. I tried to calculate how many badges would be needed, and how many pearls would be used. Three more upgrades, each upgrade requires 288 badges. And I already have 137 badges. So a total of about 720 badges are needed. So I'm going to need around 1080 pearls for that. This should be prioritized. Because tier is very important, when compared. Much more important than an additional 1000% stats. And since there's still a few days left, I'm sure I'll be able to get more pearls to get that airship part. So I'll still get both during this event. After all, there will be one more airship part task. So let's just say it's a saved score for the next task. So this is how I make a decision, stay tuned for the next video whether I made the right decision or failed to get the R9 airship part, thank you for watching, see you.